Hello parents. I hope that the little ones had fun matching the fruits and vegetables with their shadows yesterday. Today we'll again be using the foam cutouts of fruits and vegetables, but in today's activity we'll help our little ones understand sequences and patterns. So we have sent you four strips in the box. We'll be using that and helping our little ones understand how to put things in a sequential manner. So let's get started with the activity and see how it's done. Sadik, what are we going to do today? Ooh, we have all the different different fruits and vegetables here. All right, and we are going to take one one strip. Okay, so can you help me recognize the different different fruits and vegetables here? Please help me recognize them, baby. Cabbage. Tomato. No. This is as. What do you get for mama from the kitchen? Potato. No. Yes, this is a potato, and this is an onion. onion. Yes, very good. And this is a ninja. And this is a yes. Say it. Cauliflower. No. Q. Very good. Okay. So now you have love. We don't have a potato. All right. But we have an onion. We have all the other vegetables here. All right. So you have to now put them in this same order. Look here. You have this order here, right? What will come first? Onion. So put the onion next to this. Find the onion here. It is not. You found it. Put it under this onion, right below this onion here, like this. Yes. Then we don't have a potato, so skip it. Then what is this? This is a cabbage, right? You said it. Find me a cabbage. Huh? Where is the cabbage? Yeah. So put it under the cabbage there. Correctly, the correct position, like this. Yes. Now find me this brinjal. What will come after the cabbage? It is a cucumber. Cabbage ke baad kya hai ye? What is this? This is a cucumber. No, it's a brinjal. Take the brinjal and put it between the cabbage and the cucumber. Come on, quickly. I have Correctly. I have to the bin. Done. See? Okay. This is what you have to do. Now I will give you another strip. I will not tell you anything this time. All right? You will do it on your own. Yes. Now this is our last strip. All right. Now which is the first vegetable here? Fruit here. Sorry. Look here. Which is the first fruit here? Watermelon. Find it. Yeah. You are in these foam foam cutouts here. Here in this set, find the watermelon. Yeah. Very good. Put it here. Down under it. Very good. Then which 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 one is this? Mango. No. Mango. No. Pineapple. Yes. That the, the apple can. The apple can put it away. Put it away. This. Which one is this after this the? This is a cherry. Yes. Put it. What are these? These are also cherries, and these are also cherries. Put the cherries below the cherries, please. Turn them around. All right, perfect. What are these? What is this? This is an O oh, for orange. So put the orange under the orange. Yes. Then which one is the last fruit? Apple. Done. Understood how to do it. So parents, as you guys saw in today's activity, we are going to be using these four strips that we've sent you in the box along with these foam cutouts. All right. Now what you will do through today's activity is give one strip to your child at a time, and then the five fruits or vegetables of the that strip you gather them, and then you ask the child to put the fruits and vegetables in the order presented on this 
strip of paper all right so this will help them understand how to replicate patterns understand the concept of what a pattern is and get their knowledge about fruits and vegetables revised as well so that's all for today parents see you next time bye bye